Your girl placed another order on Flip and all of my packages have finally arrived. I swear my first part of the package arrived like almost a week ago and then the rest finally arrived today. So I'm very excited to get into I'm very excited to get into my order and show y'all what I got. One of the items I got was a variety pack and this is the Kettle Chips by Hal's New York. And they had so many different flavors. So far, the Buffalo Ranch has been my absolute favorite. There's still a few other flavors in here that I have to try. Those videos will be coming out shortly. So this was the first thing I got in my little haul. I believe this was one of my free items. I had two free items this time. That Buffalo Ranch one is so good. I might order a pack of just Buffalo Ranch. The next item that I ordered was a Shea Butter Mask. And this is by Real Nature. I'm gonna be honest, I only got this so that I could meet that threshold to get two products. It's clearly a Korean brand because it's all in Korean in the back. It doesn't say how long you're supposed to leave it on, but I typically leave these face masks on for like, I don't know, 15, 20 minutes. So we will definitely give this a try out at some point in time. You know, during one of our super extra nighttime skincare routines that you really shouldn't do but I'm gonna do anyways because I'm filming one of those the next item that I got and I was actually very excited to get this is by Anastasia Beverly Hills and this is the beauty balm foundation well it's not foundation serum boosted skin tint now what's very cool about this is that it looks like a stick of deodorant that's the reason why I got it I just find these deodorant stick makeup products so funny and I got mine in the shade 10 so hopefully it matches my skin tone I don't know if it will. Part of me expected this to be much bigger than it is. I don't know why, because I saw videos of people holding this in their hands, but for some reason, I thought this was gonna be much bigger. But it looks like a stick of deodorant. It even has like a little deodorant thing at the bottom. It looks like deodorant, which is so fun. It has like the nice little emblem up top. One thing that I will say, the shade range for this is horrendous. Like it is absolutely horrendous. It comes with a little safety seal like that. The shade range is disgusting. There are like a bunch of shades for lighter complexions and like three dark shades. Like I'm not even joking. The, the darker shade ranges are absolutely horrendous. So they need to fix that. I'm gonna just swipe this on and see if I got the right color. Ooh, okay, that looks like that's a perfect match. All right, I matched myself pretty nicely. Oh yeah, that blended beautifully. That went right into my skin. It like melts it in. It has a weird smell, like a, I don't know. I don't know how to how to say that smell. It smells like it just came from the box. Like this is a, inside of a box for a very long time smell, if you know what I mean. But it went into the skin beautifully. I'm very excited to try that on my face and see how I like it. I like the last skin tint that I got, the Ciate London. So I'm hoping that I will like this one as well. And I got another one of those products that looks like deodorant. <laughs> I wanna do like a full face of deodorant makeup. This one is by Pixie by Petra on the Glow Blush. And this is in the color Juicy. And this is what the packaging is looking like. Absolutely adorbs. I find these packagings by Pixie just so freaking cute. Now let's compare the sizes. I was thinking the foundation, well, serum was gonna be like this. I thought it was gonna be about this size. See, this seems like a really good size. Has another little safety seal. That is so much fun. I'm living for these deodorant stick makeups. I don't know why that's so much fun. I don't know what it is about that. That's just so much fun. But this is what the color is looking like. It's very orange. Ooh, that went on so beautifully. Let me see what happens. Kind of blend that out a little bit. Oh yeah, that's pretty. That's gonna look so freaking good. I gotta do a try on for all my new makeup because this looks absolutely stunning. They have a bronzer as well. The Pixie by Petra, they have a bronzer. I'm gonna have to try the bronzer next time. They have it on flip. So I'm gonna order it on flip. The next thing is another free item that I received. And this is the Blink Rare Gem Eyeshadow Palette. And this is what it looks like. First of all, the packaging is just absolutely stunning. This looks like it's recycled paper, which would be so amazing if it was. Ooh, I like this little detail right there. That's so pretty. I saw this eyeshadow palette on the free section, I was like, uh, duh, I'm gonna get that. Who who doesn't love a bougie eyeshadow palette? Like, let's be serious. And now this looks really good. Oh my God, you guys are seeing too much. There's the shoes, there's you. This is what it looks like. Ooh, 
okay, this is so bougie. This has to be one of the most bougiest makeups that I own. Look at that. Isn't that stunning? Like even this part you can see, you can see yourself in and it has a really big mirror at the top. Hopefully they're formulated, which we're about to find out. So I will be right back. I'm gonna do some swatches and we'll check back in. All right, y'all, here are a few of the swatches. Absolutely stunning. This top one is kind of ashy looking, but everything else showed up so beautifully. I really wanna play with this gold. This gold and then this rose gold, like literally all the shimmers are just absolutely stunning. This is more of like an everyday kind of palette. I might try to pan this one. Very pretty, very pigmented, definitely formulated. That eyeshadow palette is that girl. The next item that I got was this this Palido, Palladio, I think that's how you say it, Palladio eyeliner in the color white. I got this one so that I could tight line my waterline with white because I see the girlies doing that and it makes their eyes look so freaking huge. So I'm really excited to try this and see if it elevates my looks a little bit. Hopefully it's not too hard of a pencil. Okay, I'm gonna need this to be creamy, creamy. This is what it looks like once you get all the plastics off of her. This is the white. We're gonna go ahead and put this on right now. I don't know if I'm doing this right. Hopefully I didn't just jack my makeup look for the rest of the video. I'm like kind of scared to put it right directly in the waterline. You know what I mean? Okay, so it's definitely creamy. So you don't have to worry about it dabbing your eyes unless you like, you know, stab it into your eye. That definitely adds another dimension to the look. It makes your eyes really pop. Let me back you up just a little bit, okay? Social distancing. It's very different. I usually don't do anything like that, obviously, because I didn't have the product. But now that I do have it, I'm gonna definitely incorporate that into my looks. This is the Poppy Probiotic Soda. And now they do sell this at my local Kroger, but <laughs> I wanted to get it through Flip so that I could write reviews. Well, not write, videotape record. This is just like a probiotic, no, prebiotic soda. It is in the flavor strawberry lemon. There are several other flavors. Like I think one is like orange. Another one is like raspberry rose. They have a bunch of different flavors out there. It says this has no fake stuff in it. It's got prebiotics for your gut and it is infused with apple cider vinegar. This pop was the last thing to arrive. And when it arrived, there was like some weird wetness on the outside of the box. So I thought that one of my hands exploded, but when we checked it, nothing exploded. The box was covered in ants. Like there were ants all over the box. So whatever spilled on it was sweet. Cause if it was just rainwater, the, the ants wouldn't have been crawling over the box like they were. And some of the cans look a little bit busted. There's one that's like completely smashed in at the bottom. It is what it is. All the cans were fine though, out, outside of, you know, having some of those dents. We really Rinsed them off to make sure there were no ants. I had to open the box out. Well, I didn't open it outside, Justin did. Justin had to open the box outside because of all the ants. We didn't want them in the house. And then afterwards we rinsed off all the cans and then I put them in the fridge. So we're gonna do a little taste test, okay? We're gonna do a little taste test. This is my cute little glass that I got from FabFitFun. Justin hates this glass. <laughs> he hates them. I love these glasses. I think they're so cute. I love that sound. Ooh. It fills the cup all the way. That does not look appetizing. I'm gonna keep it a buck with y'all. The color is throwing me. Part of me thought it was gonna be pink. When you look at this can, don't you think that the contents are gonna be pink? If it tastes good, it tastes good. It smells good. It definitely smells like strawberry. Without further ado, let's see how she tastes. It's not that good. <laughs> and I think it's because it's not sweet enough for me. It's kind of like LaCroix, a little bit more flavorful. Flavorful. It has like a little bit more flavor than like a LaCroix, but it's just, it's not that great. I was expecting something a little bit more intense when it comes to flavor. This is just one of the flavors. Maybe this flavor just isn't for me. I figured that strawberry and lemon would have been delicious because I love strawberry, I love lemon. Put the lime and the coconut and mix it all up. You know what I'm saying? You know, it's not my favorite. I'm not gonna throw that away. I'm gonna finish drinking it because it is a probiotic so it'll be good for my stomach but as far as like repurchasing it's a it's a no for me dog i'm gonna go ahead and taste the original one this is the house new york kettle chip in original sea salt and this is what it looks like the other flavors that i tried were really good let's see how she tastes 
that's good. Granted, it tastes just like a Lay's or other chips that are like that. The Buffalo Ranch one is really good. That was everything in my flip order. I've already started making a little bit of money on flip. I have not made a big amount of money yet. All right, I'm not quitting my day job. I do like the platform. The discounts are really good. I get 30% off of all of my orders. I'm getting paid for making reviews, things that I was gonna do anyways. In the description box, I will have my flip link. So go ahead and click that and add me as a friend. I promise I will add you back and we can start like our own little flip community where we buy things and make money off the things we buy. If you like this content, you already know what to do. Like, share, comment, and definitely subscribe so that you can become a Fae Bay. And I will see y'all with the next one. Deuces. Mm -hmm.